Hi, I'm Robert Heron, and today we are going to learn how to unleash your personal music from your portable device to play loud and large in your home. There are many options, both on the device and technology side of things here, but we're going to break this down and make it really simple. There are three components. First, the device. We're going to call this the sending device, and it can be a smartphone, a tablet, an MP3 player, or even a laptop. Regardless of the device, this is the place where all of your personal content lives. The second important component is wireless technology. Let's talk about two technologies that allow you to stream your content from your sending device to your in-home devices. These two technologies are either AirPlay, which uses Wi-Fi, or Bluetooth, and they must be supported on your sending device to stream your music. AirPlay is Apple's wireless multimedia feature that lets users stream their content to any AirPlay-enabled playback device using their computer running iTunes or iOS devices, such as an iPhone or an iPod. All you need is a Wi-Fi network to allow the devices to talk. If streaming from iTunes on your computer, you can simultaneously stream music to multiple devices, including AirPlay-enabled AV receivers, speakers, and speaker docks. If using a portable iOS device, such as an iPhone or iPad, you can only stream to one AirPlay-enabled product. In addition to streaming your music, it also streams information about the content, like song titles, artists, album names, elapsed and remaining time, and album artwork to any AirPlay-enabled receiver or speaker display. Your other option is Bluetooth technology. Bluetooth works by pairing, so a device can only stream to one device at a time. Bluetooth also allows the device to control volume on the receiving device. The great thing about Bluetooth is that it works with nearly every mobile device and most computers, including new iOS devices. Both of these connecting technologies allow a wire-free way to play your media as loud and large as your home entertainment system allows. Speaking of, let's move on to the third thing you'll need, a receiving device. You have your sending device, you know what wireless technology your device has, and now you need to find just the right device to receive the AirPlay stream or Bluetooth connection. What you choose depends largely on your current setup. If you already have a home entertainment system with a TV, speakers, consider an AV receiver with built-in Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, and AirPlay technologies like this one here. An AV receiver acts as your home theater system's hub, and it will transmit data to your speakers. So whether you're streaming your music using AirPlay or Bluetooth, this unit has you covered. Here's how it works. Using AirPlay, you can easily stream your content from your iPhone or iPod Touch, iPad, or iTunes, along with compatible music apps like Spotify and iHeartRadio. Simply touch the AirPlay logo when it appears on your sending device and select the AV receiver model that appears on your screen and voila, your tune's amplified. For Bluetooth, just make sure Bluetooth on the sending device is paired to the receiver and turned on. This receiver even has a button on the front of the unit that enables easy pairing between devices. Lots of moving parts, I know. But just three easy steps to remember. Load your content on your sending device, determine which wireless technology you have, Get an AV receiver with Wi-Fi, AirPlay, and Bluetooth technology to receive your content. Happy streaming. On behalf of Sony, I'm Robert Heron for Houdini. For more tips, check out sony.com slash Houdini.